what's the dumbest comments you've seen and what's the dumbest questions you repeatedly see that you wish oh, people wouldn't ask? Oh, God. When I painted nails, the little fucking shit heads that were like, why are your nails painted? It's like, okay, fuckhead, how about this? Why, why, you know, I mean, obviously I want to rip into these people, but they're like 11, you know what I mean? So I'm not going to go, why are you so fucking ugly or something? I can't say that. I'm like a 12 year old kid. You're but getting I'm like, removed off the app. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But, but, but I think the scary thing was for me was like um, all these people commenting the stuff about my painted nails, which I thought was the most innocent thing I've ever done was that they all followed me. So I was like, wow, this is the sort of audience that I've been building up because I think the funniest thing is when I pay out, I do those videos like private school boy and I'm like, oh, I glassed a chick on the weekend. There's actually a huge portion of people that watch my videos and go, oh yeah, glassing chicks. And I'm like, dude, you're not like, you missed. It went the, over your head. Boat. Yeah. Yeah. Like we're you're getting on the boat, thing. dude. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you don't have any legs. You're crawling to God knows <laughs> under the floor or something. I don't know what's going on here, but like the way in different mindsets. Right? Right? Yeah. What What about you, Star? What sort of uh, the best the comments and questions that you hate the most? Um, I really like to just um, trigger people on purpose. So, like, if I make a video about something, I'll like call the item something the wrong name on purpose. Like, I always do it with the Harbour Bridge and the Anzac Bridge. I like swap the names around, and people get so fucking angry. But I really enjoy it because then it starts this like whole dialogue in the comments of like, "Yeah, you're so uh-huh. dumb." It's obviously the Harbour Bridge, and I'm like, "Well, that's the whole point of the joke. Like, don't ruin the joke." <laughs> um. Oh, well, what else was I going to say? What's another one that I get? Oh, also indicator versus blinker so i say blinker for your little thing in your car um everybody that's else fucked. reckons that's fucking cooked and they think it's called <laughs> it's, de- it's definitely indicator oh, she's I frozen indicator. Indicator. Oh, indicator. Oh, indicator. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but oh. i like to be a bit spicy sometimes i don't know <laughs> So, but that, that is so true. People get so mad at that sort yeah. of stuff. Like that is what really, but it's good for the algorithm. Yeah. It's fantastic. Yeah. I'm like yeah. boost Very the true. engagement. It's fine. Oh, the other day, yeah. Yeah. two people had a full on fucking argument in my comments. It was nothing to do with me. It was about something else. And I, it was like 50 comments in this thread. And I was like, guys, are you okay? <laughs> like, what the fuck? Yeah. yeah. I, I think po- um, as much as people hate it, like when it comes to politics, but polarization as an idea on any topic is good for entertainment. Like we had this with a client mm. recently where we did a po- we did a podcast series for them and it was called margin call, which in the finance space is a bad word. You don't use that word at all. Great movie. Um, fantastic movie. And so I strongly suggested they call it margin call and they copped so much shit from people for calling it margin call. And then when we sat down with the executives after the campaign and said, what do you think of that? And one executive is like, I fucking loved it. Another was like, I fucking hated it. I had this person calling me about it. I'm like, you guys don't get it. It's gone straight over your head. That is the, the exact point of doing that. It's to, to blow things up and get the conversation going mm. to serve you in your, and your brand essentially. And in this case for you guys, your entertainment piece. So mm. yeah, I think that's often missed by people, but Maddie, what's the, What's the comment questions that piss you off the most? Um, I think one is definitely um, like uh, people always commenting being like, oh, women think they're funny. Oh. I don't know if you get that all the time, Star, as well. It's just like, and, I'm, and it's funny because it's like I click on this person's profile and they've got like two followers in like three videos. And then, but it doesn't matter. They're probably like 10, but I'll, I'll try and be like, I don't want to put any shit out there, but I'll usually be like, I'll be like, say that to the 50,000 people that, that like it or whatever. And um, so I just yes. like put them back in their place. Um, but that's probably the one thing that really frustrates me because it's just like you obviously are like severely lacking human connection that you feel the need to just comment on someone's post that's obviously going to get a reaction out of it. Um, so that's their own um, problem. But <laughs> that's probably the only thing that pisses me off. And then also with me doing like the dandelion videos with the filter people were commenting being like it's not a filter <laughs> they thought that it was my actual face i was like what do you mean <laughs> my face doesn't look like that but no i thought that was God help but you definitely like yeah but definitely like the idea i think especially being like women in comedy definitely the idea of like only men are funny i just like i hate that i'm like anyone can be funny it doesn't matter like of like 
sexual orientation or whatever. It doesn't matter. Like anyone mm. can craft humor if you want to. I so. think that goes back to when people attack a joke based on the person delivering it and not the joke itself. Mm. Yeah. It's the same thing with any argument. If, if you attack the individual, you're sort of lost in any way. What's the logical fallacy? What's it called? And, oh, I can't even remember. Psych 1001. It's got, a, it's got a name when you attack the person rather than the argument itself. Uh, I, I, Is it ad hominem or something like that? Yeah. I, oh, what? An ad hominem attack. Is that what it is? Yeah. Like ad hominem attacks are just attacks on the individual and not the argument yeah I, you see I, it's mm. most commonly used in politics but people don't recognize it as much um when it's used about any other topic yeah i, um, I definitely cop that comment a lot as well or just in general like what pisses me off is people whether it's on my video or someone else's like people making comments about the way that you look like this is a fucking yeah life, though. but at the same time i just always think if the worst thing that someone can say about you is about the way you look like get fucked like yeah it's always a reflection of their internal insecurities but it really frustrates me because i think about if that comment was to go to someone who isn't me who isn't doesn't have a thick skin or isn't in the same mind frame as me then I feel like really protective over that person that I'm making up in my head. But you know what I mean? It's just like, and whenever I cop that, I just, usually I'll just block the person unless I can think of something funny to reply with. Like I got one from a kid once and he was like, oh like, yeah, he literally said women aren't funny or something. And I went on his profile and it said 17 in his bio. And I like replied to the comment. I was like, you don't cut it out. I'm going to call your school and you're going to get banned from going to formal. And everyone's like, ah, oh, it's so funny. <laughs> it's like, but you know, it, it's scary though, because sometimes when you call the behavior out, then your followers will then go after that person, which I believe doesn't fix the problem. It just kind of feels the fire a little bit. So it's an interesting yeah. space to step into in that regard. Like, because I think you kind of do have to be responsible for your audience to some degree, because you don't want to be fueling that negative shit because it's already so fucked on there. So I don't know. That's just my point of view. 